With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone, today's question is Acetic acid tend to dimer due to formation of intramolecular hydrogen bonding as two CH3COH molecule giving dimer CH3COH whole twice. The equilibrium constant for this reaction is 1.5 into 10 to the power 2 per molar in benzene solution and 3.6 into 10 to the power minus 2 in water. In benzene, monomer does not dissociate but in water monomer dissociates simultaneously in acid dissociation constant for this is 2 into 10 to the power minus 5. Dimer does not dissociate in benzene as well as in water. The molar ratio of dimer to monomer in 0.1 m acetic acid in benzene is equal to option A 150 ratio 1, option 2 1 ratio 150, option 3 5 ratio 2 and option D 2 ratio 5. In the question we are given then acetic acid is dimerizing in benzene as well as in water and for this reaction is 2 CH3 COOH molecules are associating together to give this dimer CH3COO whole twice. This is dimer of acid. We are given initial concentration of acetic acid is 0.1 m and its equilibrium constant in benzene is 1.5 into 10 raised power 2 and equilibrium constant in water is 3.6 into 10 raised power minus 2. If we write equilibrium constant for this reaction, then it is equal to CH3COOH whole twice divided by CH3COOH power 2. Here we can calculate concentration of CH3COOH after dimerization. In benzene, we have the value of equilibrium constant equal to 150. So, this expression can be written as 150 is equal to the concentration of dimer. The concentration of dimer can be written as 0 0.1 divided by 2 because they are present in 2 ratio 1. It means the concentration remain half in case of dimer. So, we can write 150 is equal to 0 0.1 divided by 2 divided by the concentration of CH3COOH whole power 2. The concentration of CH3COOH whole twice is equal to 0 0.1 divided by 2 multiplied by 150. Or on solving this, we get CH3COOH concentration equal to 0 0.02. This is the concentration of monomer in benzene and we have the concentration of dimer in benzene equal to 0 0.1 divided by 2 this is 0 0.05 so their ratio becomes CH3COOH whole twice divided by CH3COOH equal to 0 0.05 divided by 0 0.02 that we have calculated. So, the ratio of dimer is to monomer is 5 ratio 2 and according to this explanation, we can write the correct choice for this question is option C, 5 ratio 2 is correct answer for this question. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.